Well, we're here. Oh, wow. There's a lot of them here. Um, let's converse. A spirit voice rings within my soul. It tells me that I must give you something. Something to aid you on your noble quest. What spirit? What must we give this young human? Mineral resources? No. Important secret? No. Starship? No. Then what is the spirit spit it out? What? That there? Are you sure? Okay, here you go, Captain. Take this clear spindle. It is an ancient and powerful device built by the precursor hundreds of thousands of years ago. What does it do, you ask? I haven't the slightest idea. A special portent and serendipitous omens have foretold your arrival. Welcome, alien guest, to the home of the just and playful Pekunk. Children of the cosmic night, hobgoblins of joy, seekers of spiritual truth, and other neat stuff like that. Righto, avast! Delinquent alien Burns, you're now being... Bur uh, yeah, no. Perhaps we should introduce ourselves. I am Captain Salnick of the... <laughs> yes, yes, we know all that. Oh. We are not known throughout the galactic sector as powerful psychics for nothing. Uh. Of course, we already know the answer to this next question, too. But we enjoy conversation. Thanks. Why have you come here? Ah. Uh. Wow, we have a lot of choices. I sense a deeper reason, a deeper conflict, a conflict of immense proportion, a proportion no deeper reason, a deeper thing that is not too terribly deep, a conflicting deeper thing. Uh, I'm not really sure what I sense. Are you sure there isn't something you want to say to me? Uh. I am forming a psychic link with you. I sense that you refer to a conflict with the illness. I sense that you are offering to venture single-handedly deep into Irrat space and to battle with their vast numbers. And I can see that you give not even a thought to the danger you would be in. You are noble indeed, and I accept your offer of aid. But in spirit alone, the karmic burden of your gruesome death would be too great. Still, I say thank you, Captain. Let us unite and form an alliance. We will provide you with all of the crew, ships, and resources you desire. We will give you... Wait! I sense that you are offended by our crack material offer. Yes, I am ashamed. Any warmongering species could offer this. We are the Kunk, children of the stellar breeze. We shall give you what all others could not. The greatest of gifts. We shall give you our love. Ah, you are speechless. Do not talk now. I can feel the energy connecting us. Let us talk while the silence remains. Farewell. But wait, before we go, as a small token of our love, not as a material gift, mind you, we give you four of our mega ships, fully crewed. Good luck. What? Oh, sweet. Wait, 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 wait. Captain, we have been expecting you, of course. In fact, you're here because we wished you to be here. By channeling our psychic energies through a trans-dimensional flux inducer, we were able to affect the low-frequency stream of a soul particle such as yourself and direct its course. The only thing is, we can't remember why we brought you here. Why should we mind? We bear the spidery creatures no ill will. Without darkness, there is no light. Without death, there is no birth. And thanks to the Irrat, there's lots of birth. Is that so? Hmm. A 
an interesting question. The answer would be yes. If some benign and loving yet incredibly destructive and powerful force were to simultaneously rip off all of their legs and drop their putrid egg sacs into steaming pools of molten metal, that would have the desired result of ending the conflict. Oh, <laughs> but I jest. Of course, I bear the ill wrath, no ill will. How could I, when I'm filled only with love? Ah. Oh. Uh, listen. We have delved most deeply into the dark and greasy heart of the hill there. And what do you suppose we found there? Well, we found a torpid, vile, malign, obvious, spiteful spirit. Right, no surprises there. What did surprise us, though, was what we saw when we regressed into the past life. It turns out that in their last lives, the Ilrath were all shining beings of pure light and blissful love. They had reached the pinnacle of spiritual evolution and could go no further. They were perfection. And then, somehow, they got just a tiny bit better and wham! They were all of a sudden totally evil. Wouldn't you know it? Get too perfect and you wrap right around to evil. That's why we the cunt strive to be perfect, but always do little bad and annoying things to keep from ending up like the ill <laughs> oh. Well, that's easy. It was exactly 27,000 rotations of the sun planet in the house of Plasti Farm. Before the first alignment of the auspicious constellation of Big Big with the heavenly body of Shamla Thun, which was really only a partial alignment. I guess you would say eight years ago. Oh. We have calculated that at our present rate of attrition, we will exist only on the spiritual plane in a matter of a year or so. Oh. Of course, the physical realm does hold a certain coarse attraction, a material quaintness, if you will. We will be somewhat disappointed to have to leave it. Oh. Yes, you're right. Why dwell on the heinous ill rat when we could speak of flowers, rainbows, fairies, and crystal magic? Did you know, for example, that there is an invisible fairy spirit at this moment sitting on your head and making humorous faces at me? Ah, the mysteries of the universe! Try to understand them, but can you? Nope, they're mysteries! <laughs> Not at all! We are, after all, a fascinating species. Of course, modesty prevents me from talking at length. Although perhaps if you were to ask me specific questions, propriety might be better served. Aha. Uh -huh. Um... Oops. Yes, it's a wet. A vision comes upon me. A shining light. A crack in the egg, a swirling vortex, a tunnel. I see my past lives, your past lives, more shining light. Ah, there it is now, the future. It's coming in clearer. Yes, I see tears, tears of joy. They are coming from our Yeha brothers and sisters who welcome us back to the nest. Wings outstretched. Beats stuffed with grub. Soon we shall return. Soon. Where's the Yeehaw? Ah, an intelligent question. But where to begin? Surely you know that we, the Kunk, were once one in the same species as the Yeehaw. Yes, it's true. We were once brutal birds of prey, oblivious to the mysteries of crystal magic or the seven dimensions of psychic beings. It was not until Weenie Winky Bicky Birdie sat on the mystical egg of ice-like temperature and gave the original squawk RUP 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 BEGAN! That our transformation began! It was the squawk RUP 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 BEGAN! That triggered the harmonic oscillations that would lead us to become the enlightened aliens that we are. Wow. That depends on how you define friendly. We love our Yehat brethren, whereas they open fire on our vessels on sight. 
Unfortunately, our psychic abilities allow us to sense the deep abiding love and yes, even shyness in our Yeha brothers and sisters. How we must have hurt them when we left so long ago. Soon though, it will be time for the loving reunion as our destiny is fulfilled and we are once again reunited as one people. Ah. Just off the top of my beak, I suppose I would say that our culture could be defined as the ultimate unification or oneness, if you will, of the extra-dimensional convergent chakra being energies to form a togetherness self which both is and is not a combination of the now essence. An excellent question. The answer is in itself an answer containing the explanation you seek. And more! Let me say, the revelation includes the mysteries of pyramid power, which is merely a subset of the greater and more general funky power. UFOs and FOs are significant, but their role should not be overplayed. I'm sorry, but I can be no more specific than that. Yes, you are right. I should be careful not to overwhelm you with my psychic intensities. Perhaps we could talk about something less overwhelming, albeit less interesting. Farewell, kind humor. Return soon. Wow. Uh, thanks, Bakunk. I think they're losing the war against the Illrath, those spidery guys. The big red spider creatures that we fought. Hmm. Yeah, it's not looking so hot around here. Kind of bleak in a way. Oh my. Yeah, the Bakunks isn't so... The Illrath. Should we go in there and fight them? We need to find the Yeehaw. Then we need to go to the Zaphoth pit quick. Um. Well, we're headed back though to Starbase. Let me see if I can... Avoid whoever these are. Oh yeah, who's faster? And now we'll turn on autopilot. Getting that maximum thrust is just the best purchase I've ever made. I just cannot risk if that's Slylandro. Because if it is... Oh yeah, this one is Slylandro. The other ones are probably Pekunk. They faded off. Because they went outside of their territory. We might be in for a battle. It's good to see you again, Captain. Thank you, sir. Wow, you really hit the mother load this time. Thank you, that was my best. The analysis reads as follows. Subject, clear spindle device. Data, the object in question has no clear use or means of activation, but does have superconductive characteristics between 18 and 22 degrees centigrade. We suspect that it is a precursor manufacturer, but we cannot be certain without extended study. Summary. In all likelihood, this object is part of a larger device whose capabilities remain unknown. That's the end of our scientist's report. Oh. Bring back lots of minerals, Captain. Fair enough.
More dynamo. And eventually I'll need more fuel. And then eventually I'll need another crew pod. I don't know if this is an intelligent build. Um, extra crew and fuel. But I've upgraded my rear guns to run away. Maybe I can knock off the Slylandro with my Vindicator ship. But I'm going out there to fight him, whoever it is. Oops. Who's this? Why, my goodness, it's the Slylandro. We bring greetings from a friendly species. Oh, thank you. This okay, let's see how this works. Oh, sweet. That's not bad. Oh, that's rather good, actually. I'd like more dynamo. Yes, if we can do that, then we do not fear the Slylanjo anymore. Yes, we just have to keep our distance. Sweet, 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 sweet. Okay, we, we might be able to cheese it this way. Well, where are we going? Oh, what do we need to do? Um, Spathy Homeworld or Yeehat? Yeehat are the brethren of the Pekunk. They're probably not too far away. Eta Potomi. Let's just do the Potomi place. Deneb. And the Chaley. Okay, told me it is. We'll start from. We'll start from the western side and work our way east. I think. And then if we get enough awesome stuff from this. We'll swing back up to Alpha Centauri and see if we can get more alien technology. From the... Malnorme? Eta Potomi is a huge place. Well, we'll do the outside planets first. about this place it seems like these deposits are rather large Should be good for the last one here. Some earthquakes. 
I need a nice, calm planet that's just teeming with life. They never make it easy, though, do they? Oh, there's one more down here I didn't see. I would have swung by and got it. Wow, I actually landed on it for once. That was neat. Pretty, pretty nice planet. There's some life here. Wonder what kind it is. Oh, these things. They're pretty weak. Yeah, we're definitely going back to the Malmer May. destroying these things though they're so cool because once they're gone they don't come back anymore but if I don't kill them I would be unable to get upgrades Unable to progress. But this background music kind of makes me feel like I'm the author of some horrible futuristic genocide. I just want to go about my business collecting things in a Easy to follow order. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff over here too. It's a little bit earthquakey. Whoa, whoa. That was scary. What is this? Whoa, uh -oh. oh no. Panic. At the disco. No. Better guns. That's not too terrible. What is that? Can I shoot it? There's flowers here that I'm shooting? thing is hurting when I shoot it. Ah. Hey, we don't care about such things around here. We're ruthless explorers. Okay. Care about the feelings of some... That's, that's silly, that's silly. Progress at all costs. Here we go. It'll grow back, I'm telling you. No monsters this time. Okay. Watch out for earthquakes. Go down in one fell swoop. Free rat.
That's awesome. I really hope right now I'm not running out of time to save the Zatfa pick and the Pakunk. Am I wasting time? How much time do I have to explore like this? There's hundreds of stars out there. Ooh, this place is a little bit dangerous. Watch out. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. That's not nice. Not nice. But I had to get that formaldehyde. Four crew dead or more for formaldehyde. Maybe some moons. Temperature's nice. Dehydrated what? That should do nicely. What about you, my fine fellow? Just kidding. Oh my goodness, the weather is really bad. Uh, I don't know if I should do this. Oh, yeah. That isn't happening. The weather's even worse here. But if we can get just this one. Nope. That was a little too far away. Nope. There's even fire there. I tried a couple times. I'm gone. Thank you. That looked harrowing. Is that a Potomac? It is. Oh, sweet. This looks pretty nice and small for us. I think there's a Mm. Where is the... Ah, there he is. Good show, good show. Not too bad. Might see an earthquake or two. to collect down here. Always good to get Argon. Mm, I wonder if we'll run into any heat. Yeah, I think we will. Nice green dwarf. Can we go to the middle and scan the sun? What is this place? fly through the sun. Okay, this place could be hot. A little bit tricky here. Oh no, it's not too bad. <gasps> and there's creatures everywhere. Okay, oh. Oh, the weather is not so great. Ow, ow, ow. Weather is much more dangerous than tectonics, and that place is both. So I am out of here. Thank you, Zeta. You are a fascinating place. 
now we will be off to Epsilon. Oh, nice small place. They follow me in from hyperspace. That would be most ideal. Oh well, this place doesn't have much. Except a bunch of earthquakes. Going to Deneb? Huh, why not? Oops. Ha 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 